Hey guys, welcome back to another guitar lesson. Today we're gonna learn how to play One Direction's You and I. So, it's been a while since I've done a One Direction tutorial and I'll be doing more. So if you're new to my channel, then you should definitely check out the playlist that I've created for all One Direction guitar lessons. I will leave a link in the video. To play this song and to be in the same key as the original song, you need to have a capo on the first fret. Okay, now this song uses some pretty easy chords, so you know, if you're a beginner, then you should definitely try this out. And we're also going to learn how to play a li the little solo that comes during the end. So let's get into it. Let's see how to play the intro first. Then you start singing the verse. So we start out on F major. To play F, you need 3rd frets on the 5th and 4th strings, 2nd fret on the 3rd string, 1st fret on the 1st 2 strings. Now in the intro, we are only strumming till 2nd string, because we need this note, like this. You know, so on F major, you do two down strums. And then you move to the next chord, which is G major. So you will get. Okay, now for G major, how you play that is third fret in the top string, second fret, in the fifth string, open, open and 3rd fret again on the 2nd string. So again, you can play the 1st string as well, but for the intro, we're only strumming till the 2nd string. So how you mute the 1st string is by just putting your little finger on the string. So the rest of the fingers, I'm pressing it down on the string to make the note sound, but the last one, I'm just putting it over there, so not pressing it, right? So that's how you make sure you get this important third note on the second string. So you get down, down, up, down, up, on G. Then you come to A minor. That's what you do on A minor. Down, 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 up. For A minor you need fifth string open. 2nd fret, 2nd fret on the 4th and 3rd strings, 1st fret on the 2nd string, and you need the 1st string now open, because to get that note, right, so you go down, down, up, down, up, on A minor you do down, and then do down, 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 down. okay, so the first down strum is on the upper strings, and then down, down, up is on the lower strings. So from the beginning you get this. Down, down, up, down, up, down. Okay, the first down strum is on all the strings and then down. This one is on the upper strings and then down, down, down. So down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 down. Now you come to C major, down, So for C major, you just need to lift your ring finger from the 2nd fret on the 3rd string to the 3rd fret on the 5th string. And you need the 1st string open as well. In case you need that, uh, your um, arm to go down on the 1st string as well. So from the beginning, down, down, up, down, 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 down. On C major, down. Okay, just down, 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 up, and on F major again, the first chord that we used, play the same chord, and over here again you do down, down, down. So on C major and F major you do down, 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 up, down, down, down. So from the beginning, down.
repeat this whole thing one more time. And then you start with the verse. Now the verse goes like this. repeat this again okay so we're starting out on G major now for G major again uh, I'm playing the second string open and to mute the first string you can just keep your pinky finger on the first string now, if you're having difficulty in doing all of this just go ahead and play the regular G chord okay doesn't make a difference so but you know it sounds better to me if we don't play the first string at least for the verse so the strum pattern is what we need to take care of now when the verse begins there's a very casual approach towards the strum pattern you know the, your hand is moving freely so on g major you do down down up down 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 okay that's what we have for now then we're going to go into the next part so let's see again what happened over here play with me down Okay, that's the first part. Make sure you rewind the video if you haven't got this again because I'll be moving ahead with the strum pattern. So you want to rewind the video and then practice along with me. Okay, so once more, G major, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down. And then you go to the next part, which is up, down, down, up. Because this up, down, down, up, you know, this strum pattern comes with a couple of different chords. So it will go like this. Up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down. You know, so up, down, down, up is the next part on G. And then you come to the next chord. Down, down, up. So till now, you've got this on G major. Down, down, up, down, 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 down. And then up, down, down, up. Just down, down, up on the next chord, which is going to be your D over F sharp. So to play that, you need second fret on the top string. Again, if you're having difficulties, just leave that out. Play the normal D major. Open on the fourth string, second fret on the third string, and third fret on the second string. So you get down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up. So on D word F sharp, you just do down, down, up. And down, down, up is still the second string. I'm not playing the first string again. Okay? And then you come to E minor. So from the beginning again, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up. Come to E minor, down, down, up, down, 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 down. Okay? That's all that you do on E minor. Down. C major down down up down 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 okay now when I'm playing this you know sometimes I might change the strum pattern do it like down down up down up down 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 up you know so don't worry about that just go with the basic version let's play again whatever you've learned from the beginning down down up down 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 up down down up down thing on E minor you're gonna play the lower strings as well okay down down up down 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 up come to C major down down up down 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 and repeat all of this one more time That's one thing that you can do on E minor instead of down, down, up, down, 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 up. You can go down, down, up, down, up, down, down. Come to C major. Down, down, up, down, up, down, down, down. And then we come to the precursor of the song. Tight like us, there 
wanna fight like us. Okay, so once again, guys, if you didn't get it, please rewind the video and uh, make sure you rewind the parts that you couldn't understand and play it along with me. Now you come to the pre-chorus of the song. So we left on C major, right? From E minor to down, silence and sound. Down, 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 up C. Okay, so it's left D1 C, down, down, up, down, 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 up. Come to E minor now. Just play it once, strum once on the upper strings, okay? Don't have to go to the, to the lower strings. Then come to D over F sharp. Now we're here, you need that second fret on the top string, okay? Just play the upper strings again. And then C. Okay, so these are together. And wait, did they ever? Back to E minor. D over F sharp, three, four, and then you go to the chorus of the song. Now let's see how to play the chorus of the song. And for the chorus, the beginning is the same as the intro of the song. Check this out. Okay, so let's see once again from the beginning, F, G, a minor, just like the intro. Down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 down. So I hope I don't have to go through this again. It's same as the intro, C major. Down, 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 up, F, down, 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 up. That was the intro. After that, you were repeating this again for the intro. But here in the chorus, you now go to E minor. We can make it till the end. So on E minor, you do down. F major again, down, 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 up. And then you come to this exciting part on G major, nothing can come again. Okay, so it's down, down, up, down, up, down. Now, if you notice, I'm playing the lower strings again. Third frets on both first and second strings. Okay, down, down, up, down, up, down. So, if you play the chorus again from the beginning, down, down, up, down, up, down. See, after G major, down, down, up, down, up, down, quickly move, quickly move back to U and I. Again, so you see, same thing, and after that, again, U and I. Okay, so the last part might be a little confusing. Let's go through it one more time. The second part of the chorus, not even the gods above. Let's start it from over there. So. To F G and A minor, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, C, down, 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 up, F, down, again, you and I, down, 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 up, C, down, 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 up, F, down, 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 up, G. Now you know what to do. Play the second verse exactly the same as the first verse. So let me just go through it, sing through it for you.
Okay, so this was exactly the same as the first was, and the pre-curse was also the same. Then you go to the curse again, same as the first curse. You know how to play it already. Right? You just play through it. Minor. to stop on F major okay so last line of the chorus second chorus okay so stop on F major so down 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 up down just do a simple down strum two three four and then you come to the solo of the song instrumental section and the chords behind the solo, let me just go through the chords that you can play behind the solo are the same as the chorus basically. Down, down, up, down, up, down, A minor. Then you come to E minor, that's the difference. Down, down, up, F major again. Down, down, up, and then down, down, up, down, up, down. So you see there's an E minor over there. And then once again the whole thing. Then you come to the chorus of the song, which will be the last chorus of the song, the final chorus, same as all other choruses. How to play all of this now? No, nothing can come between you and, and that's how the song ends. Just keep on repeating the chorus. We can make it if you try. You know, and that will be the end of the song because the song fades away you know in the end it doesn't stop it just fades away so it fades away in the chorus of the song all right so that's how you play you and i by one direction it was a long long lesson but i'm sure it was worth it now i just want to show you how to go through the solo of the song this comes after the second chorus okay so it goes like this So we start out on 6th fret and this is not relative to the capo, this is just relative to the nut, so 6th fret, okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, I'm just going to be counting, you know, the number of um, picks over here, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then you, you just want to slide all the way up to the 10th fret. So you see this total of 10 counts over here. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, and. And then again you do 4 counts over here. 1, 2, 3, 4. And then 4 counts over here on the 14th fret of the 2nd string. 4 counts on the 13th fret. And 4 counts on the 11th fret. So. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, and 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 1, 2, 3, 4, so 4 times on the 9th fret, 1, 2, 3, 4, and then just do a pull off from 11th fret to the 9th fret again, then play twice that again. And then four times on 13, 
four times on 11. And then one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. You can do eight times over here and then go back to, just repeat the whole thing again. Okay, all right, so that's how you play You and I by One Direction. Hope you like the lesson. Make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to my channel if you're new. And I will see you guys next time with another song lesson. Till then, goodbye and take care.